Hey everybody, it's Eric. Welcome back to the channel. Let's dive into the stock market forecast for next week. We're going to look at the weekly forecast from Alpha Crunching for the week of June 30th. Today is Saturday, June 28th. So doing this quick video before the trading week begins, which is what the forecast is for. We can see that the forecast from Monday all the way to Friday is basically net bullish, not too surprising here, but it is a little bit more bullish than last week. We can look at last week's forecast, which we have net positive numbers in terms of SPX points. And we are looking for potential weakness at the end of the week, but we did not get that last week. We got a full blown rally to new highs. We'll take a look at that here. We did push up against the, the newly revised rolled up 6,200 call wall. We'll find out, find out next week if this rolls even higher. Uh, however, we are, you know, in the current option levels, we are kind of in the upper part of the range. So we're basically in a buy the dip mode. It's really hard to get long up here. I understand that, but it, we, you know, any kind of pullback to 61, uh, 50, 25, or even 6,100 is probably a good buying position. Uh, the forecast metrics, uh, because we are stronger than last week, everything is looking up. Our net deltas, that's the average amount that SPX closes higher at the end of the week, is higher. Directional strength ratio and our average strength deviation. So everything is pointing up, but again, we could have a little bit of a pullback. This week is a little bit different because we're running into a holiday week. Friday is July. July 4th, the market will be closed. And Thursday, July 3rd, the market's closing early, I believe at 1 p.m. Eastern. So not much going on on Monday, but a lot of data coming out on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday to look out for. So we'll see if the dovish Fed will continue and if the trade wars and all that stuff can kind of stay tamed, then the market could maybe get a little bit of pullback early in the week and maybe we can uh, continue higher. So that's what I got for this video. We'll see you in the next one.